My father uh, came from Poland, Zhezhny uh, or Brzezine. Yeah. I would go down to the Brzezina meetings and Geschrei going on. My father's nah, it's nothing, that's why they talk. Turned me off. Because he wanted me to become part of Brzezina. The children of the Brzezina didn't join. So they were dying out and they moved from 48th Street, they ended up on Hudson Street, New York, in a building where all these fraternal organizations would be housed. And the only reason it was revived is because the Holocaust victim was coming here. And I visited there in 2005. There were 12,000 in this, in this town, very successful, the finest tailors in Europe. Thanks to Hitler, 6,000 were annihilated. And the only thing that remains is a wooden door in white and blue commemoration of 6,000 Jews out here. And uh, we were with a woman because someone wrote the story of the Brzezinas, both Poland and here. Uh, uh, I got her name and she actually took us from Warsaw down to Brzezina. And while we're looking at this door next to it, there's a hallway with a large, what was a large door, and there's a groove for the mezuzah. And I look at this thing, and Anna, the guide, says, wow. And she started taking pictures, of course. She was working on Jewish history in Poland, getting a doctorate at Brandeis. So I got a favor for the world my father lived in.